OCD is a severe mental disorder that is characterized by symptoms of obsession and compulsion. What we know is that there is a specific circuits in the brain that are impacted by uh, the disorder. So the idea of the trial was to try to test if a specific non-invasive and neuromodulation protocol could restore the activity of uh, uh, this network. The technique is called transcranial magnetic stimulation. What we're gonna do is uh, stimulate the uh, right motor cortex. The location is approximately around here. And we're gonna record a response in the muscle. There we go. You can see the movement the stimulation for the repetitive stimulation that is here at the front will be 70% of uh, that threshold. So we specifically target the right frontal pole. So we can see it over here. And then using this neuronavigation software, we're allowed to pinpoint exactly where in the brain to stimulate. And then they underwent 20 sessions of uh, brain stimulation, one to Friday for uh, four weeks. Uh, after that, they had uh, pre and post a comprehensive psychiatric and clinical assessment. So the, this was a random, randomized control, a sham control trial. So it means that there is a group that underwent uh, an active intervention, and then there is a sham group. The stimulation was done with uh, a placebo. So what we found is that uh, the active intervention didn't perform better than the sham. The parameter that we use for this uh, therapy, uh, it doesn't seem to work. This is a really critical information. I think it's really important to understand that the failure what bring to the success eventually. This uh, trial was really important to uh, move on and develop the next set of intervention that we are going to do in the next few years.